The state says the deaths caused by distracted driving went down last year. But a glance at a driver in the next car, mm, that may tell you we still have a long way to go. Mark Mulholland tells us what's being done and why it's too late for a woman who lost her father to a distracted driver. Mark? Well, Benita and Jim, Karen Torres lost her father when a distracted cement truck driver struck and killed him. I knew something was going to happen. It wasn't supposed to be this way for Patrick Mapleson. The DOT worker was just to seven months from retirement. Oh, my dad. Karen Torres's eyes light up as she talks about her father's life. Those same eyes well with tears as she speaks about his death. My sister was there and we just started screaming. Her dad was working on a pothole crew when a cement truck came barreling into the work zone. The driver had reached down to pick up a water bottle. And by the time he looked back up, he had crossed over the closed lane and he slammed to the work zone. And that's where he hit and killed my father. She told the story Tuesday as the governor's traffic safety committee rolled out a new campaign targeting distracted driving. Children learn from our behaviors. What kind of driver are you raising? You'll see commercials and billboards soon. <laughs> to do more to ensure that these types of tragedies do not occur. Police will be out in force beginning Thursday, targeting those of us not focusing on the road. If the deaths and injuries caused by distracted driving are 100% preventable when motorists put down their handheld devices and keep their eyes on the road. Karen Torres hopes the enforcement and the billboards work. I am living proof that by somebody taking their eyes off the road for just a second, killed my dad. The governor's traffic safety committee says the billboards are already up and TV stations will start running the commercials this week. Reporting live in our Saratoga newsroom with coverage you can trust, I'm Mark Mulholland. Benita, back to you. Powerful reminders, Mark. When you drive, keep your eyes on the road. Thank you.